Good morning, students. Today we will discuss about cell. Cell is the basic structural and functional microscopic unit of and functional microscopic unit of unit of living organism. This is discovered by Robert Hooke in 1665 in plant cell a plant in cork slice. This cell was dead cell while the living cell is discovered by A.V. Leeuwenhoek. Now we discuss about cell theory. which is given by Schleden and Schwann. Cell theory was given by cell theory was given by Schleden and Schwann. According to cell theory all plants and animals are composed of cell. All plants and animal are composed of cell. Cell is the basic unit of all living organism. Cell is the basic unit of cell is the basic unit of all living organisms. Now the cell theory was expanded by Rudolf Virchow and he said and he said new cells are new cells are arise from pre existing cell. pre existing cell the exception of cell theory was exception of cell theory was virus or is virus virus lack any membrane and do not show characteristics of life until they enter a living body and when they enter in a living body or living cell. They use its machinery to reproduce. Now on the basis of number, cells are of two types. Now on the basis of number, cells are of two types. First one is unicellular, means those organisms which contain only a single cell. While the second one is multicellular organisms, means those organisms which contain more than one cell. Unicellular organisms are like amoeba, paramecium, while the multicellular organisms are fungi, plant cells, plants, and animals. Now on the basis of their modification or advancement again cell are of two types. First one is prokaryotic cell, prokaryotic cell while the second one is eukaryotic cell. Prokaryotic cells are primitive cells and incomplete cells. They do not have basic structures of true cell like nuclear membrane, cell organelles. While the eukaryotic cells are advanced cells and they have all characters of true cell. Prokaryotic cells are like bacteria, 
cyanobacteria well the eukaryotic cells are plant cell animal cell cells have different different size and shape so according to size largest cell is ostrich egg which is 18 cm with shell or with outer shell while the 15 cm is without shell the smallest cell is mycoplasma while the longest cell is nerve cell and according to shape these are of several types like spherical elongated branched discoidal now we will discuss about cell structure we will discuss about cell structure in three parts first one is cell coat second one is cytoplasm and third one is nucleus now cell coat has two parts first one is cell wall and second one is cell membrane now cytoplasm is also divided into two parts first one is hyloplasm first one is hyloplasm while the second one is trophoplasm hyloplasm means without cell organelles cytoplasm while the trophoplasm include all the cell organelles in cytoplasm now trophoplasm contain membranous structure and non membranous structures membranous structures and non membranous structure membranous structure are again two types or three types first one is single membranous double first one is single membranous structure second one is double membranous structure and third one is membranous structure have two types single membranous structure and double membranous structure single membranous structure contain endoplasmic reticulum golgi apparatus or golgi body lysosomes vacuoles peroxisomes and glyoxisomes while the double membranous structure contain mitochondria and plastid while the non membranous structure include ribosomes centrosomes and third one is cytoskeletal elements